close the prison. I then take the rest of it, pour it down the barrel, along with the wadding and the bowl in the end. Once again, I'm expected to do this three, four times a minute. Take out the scouring stick. You'll notice I'm moving my hand away. This is just a safety thing that we do, so that way if my hand's over it and goes off, I don't lose everything. <laughs> Granted, they wouldn't do this so gingerly back then. You're in a battle situation, you just want to load it and fire it. Now, the piece is ready to fire. Now, Mr. Well, Captain, Captain Gold will be firing his at the same time. I will do mine over here, he will do those over there, so everybody can get a good view of it. Now, this wasn't a type of weapon that you see, once again, like in the movies, where someone's standing 30 yards away and they fire a shot and they hit it and it's beautiful. Uh-uh. That's not how we pirates did it. It was close quarters on that ship. If we're all on a pirate ship, all fighting each other, you think you're going to have room to ha-ha and shoot somebody? No. We're going to be standing next to this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to run up to you with my sword, I'm going to hack you in the neck, and I'm going to stick this in your gut and pull the trigger. So with that in mind, <laughs> think of this going off in your stomach. Ready? Aim! Fire! <laughs> Again! That's embarrassing. What? <laughs> Mine brings... work. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey. But it brings up a good point, mates. <laughs> this would happen in battle. A misfire. And you know that second that I just lost of this not going off? I could have lost me life. So, this happens. Let's see if we can do it this time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what'd you do to me? <laughs> <laughs>